I'm going to review with you in this video how to make an improper fraction. Remember, an improper fraction is when the numerator is higher than the denominator, and we want to turn these into mixed numbers. And I'll use my material to show you. So here I have 5 thirds. So I grab 5 thirds out of our fraction box. And let's make circles out of these. There's one hole. Two more. So we have one hole plus two more thirds. There's our answer for that. Now, you might not have the, the, you probably don't have these fraction materials at your house. So how can we think of this without using the materials? Well, we can think, how many times can three go into five? If you're not sure, we can skip count. Threes, three, six, well, we can't go past five. So this is too much. So three can only get fit into five one time. And then we have two left over. To get to five, we need four, five. So two left over. Let's try it with 11 fourths. Let's try it without the material first. Let's see if we can get the correct answer. So four can go into 11 how many times? If we're not sure, let's skip count. Four, eight, 12. Oop, 12 is higher than 11, so we'll stop there. Okay, so we know that it can, four can go in 11 twice. And how many more do we need to get to 12? Or, I'm sorry, how many more do we need to get to 11? So we stopped at eight, nine, 10, 11. So we need three more fourths. So it can go in twice, and there's going to be three fourths left. Let's see if we're correct. There it is. We have two holes and there's three fourths left over. So these fractions we could say are equivalent. This is the improper fraction. This is the mixed number, but they equal the same thing. We just wanna write our answers in mixed number form. Thanks for joining me at this review.